Hey, it's Dee Pom from Write Your Way In. I'm going to read you a piece that was inspired by Pat Schneider's We Shall Know Each Other. And the line was, by the rivers in the palms of our hands, that I took off on. How shall we know each other? The memory of a touch or the curve of a hip won't be enough. Not then. No rough tenor or wind chime laugh. Just the rustle of dried grasses, the curl of surf taking back pebbles, the blinking of sun through leaves. We've been through this before, the searching. Once it was through the pages of phone books in every passing town. Letters returned with a slash, no forwarding address. It's different now, no more libraries. No more crowds in local markets where anyone's back might be yours. The streets have been shaken out, emptied save for the destitute, rags and bones. And if I should pass you, not in an airport, no, but perhaps in a line waiting six feet from the next, your beautiful mouth will be concealed. And we are old now. It's easier too, perhaps, a press on a button, slide of the finger, screen after screen of images, none of them yours. One mention of your name from eight years ago is all I found. How shall we know each other then? I'm easy to find. I go by many names, some of which you know. It wouldn't take much to find me. In fact, if you looked, I mean, if you wanted to. You once traced the lines of my palms, my monkey palms, I said, pulling them away behind my back, the lines deep, the skin like leather. No man should hold these hands. You reached for them, and I brought them out like a confession. I'm the missing link, I said with a sideways laugh. You are my missing link, you said. That's what you said. We'll be better off without bodies. That's what I think. These hungry, aching vessels that make bad smells and want far too much. When we get to go home, not that third floor apartment with its red and yellow flowered window seat, or the house where you and your wife live. That's right. It took a long time, but I did find you, the house with its red and yellow balcony, the riot of flowers in the window boxes, the smell of the ocean. No, not that home. But when we do at last get to go home, I won't hear your rough tenor voice, nor you my wind chime laugh. How will I know you then? By the blink of sun through leaves, the paper rustle of dried grasses, the scrabble of pebbles in the surf. Still, if you wanted to, before our bodies drop and we can no longer know each other as we once did, you could try. I'm not that hard to find.